How are we doing guys? So we're just up at John's now. Um, it's been a month, well near enough a month since we've um, installed this pond. But he's not had a UV on it. Um, the UV that he had, the ballast broke. Um, anyway, he's got this. 35 quid, 50 watt UV. But we tried to install it and all the pipe work that he's got it's just brittle and it's there's holes in it everywhere and it's leaked so i'm going to take a trip down to holmeswood coy get some proper pipe um get this uv on get this thing cleared up um probably do a bit of a filter clean water change i'm going to do a water test on it as well i'm going to do a water test on it as well because uh it's never been done in the, in the uh, since we've done it so yeah bit of a bit of a maintenance video try and get this pond back to clear or well, why i do a water test or Everything's a bit high, so it'll be cut down on feeding, plenty of water changes till everything sorts itself out. Right, so this is the stuff that was on, crap stuff, crap corrugated stuff. Yeah. When we pulled it out to do the UV, it had holes all the way through it, it cracked everywhere. We tried connecting the UV, it just honestly, it was a mess. So we've got this stuff instead, stronger. Do you know what? It's only five pound a metre. It's pretty cheap that as well. Right guys, so easy pod's been cleaned out a few times. Water levels dropped, so we're gonna give it a good water change just because we're not gonna be back up here for a bit. Um all the pipe work underneath the easy pods tidied up, earth stones are in nicely instead of just floating all over the top. 55 watt watt UV is on. Good stuff. So how long do we reckon it's going to take to clean that green soup? Put drop it in the comments.
Guys, um, so yeah, four days it's took to clear. Um, I did say I weren't going to come back up for a bit, but I had a message off John asking me to come up. Um, he's bought me a fish, and yeah, well out of the blue, really appreciate it. But he's bought me a little butterfly fish, so I've come back up, so I might as well finish this video with the... Um, With how it with how it looks. I don't think you can see it on the uh, video, but you can actually see the bottom. It's looking good. So I say a big thanks to Kathy for coming out every day, every day, and sending me an update video of how it was clearing. Oh yeah, looks amazing. I think. Um, Give it another couple of days and it'll be spot on. I mean, it's spot on already. That's right at the bottom, that. He's bought a new little sturgeon. I don't know if you can see that. Albino sturgeon. So what's going to happen now over the next couple of days are for the goldfish that are in here, um, the bream, the roach, there's about 50 fish in here altogether. So all the bream, the roach, the goldfish, they've all got new homes. So they'll all get moved on over the next couple of days. That'll let, that'll probably help with these uh, water parameters. And it'll get this pond. You can sit down, sit back and enjoy the pond. Um, I don't know if you can see this little butterfly fish because it's in a bag light. But Can't really see it. Well, I'll get it on and I'll and I'll show you. But yeah, big thanks to John and Kathy for buying me the fish. Like, really appreciate it. John's little new butterfly fish. Though he's got it's pretty nice. That in it. I don't know if you can see all the black shadows going past. Oh, there are all the mirror carp, common carp. Looks really good, doesn't it? Right, so I'm on now. Um, yeah, that was really like unexpected. Thanks to um, John and Kathy, they really didn't have to. I mean, building that pond, it was fun. I enjoyed doing it, I didn't expect nothing for it. Um, yeah, he they, they got two butterfly fish and a sturgeon, which I'll, uh, I'll just crop in here some from um, Carp Corps, uh, next day delivery. I think he ordered it, he said he ordered them yesterday and they was here by nine o'clock this morning. Um, pretty lovely little uh, little Sankey butterfly, I think the Sankey or Shuller's the one of them. I, I, I get mixed up on them, but. Yeah, I'll spin you around now and uh, I'll let you have a look. You love a fish, don't you, mate? Lovely little gift, isn't it? Um, yeah, so that's the end of this video, really. So it took four days for that UV to clear up that 5,000 litre pond. Not bad, that is it. Right, so I'm just going to say thanks for watching. And I'll definitely see you all in the next one.